Hello everyone and thank you for your interest in Loudmouth. In this tutorial we will be covering the basics on how to use the Loudmouth and the Loudmouth HUD. If you don't know how to use the edit menu and or have never used the tools before, there are some helpful tutorials online and in world to help you get started. If you still wish to follow along, you're more than welcome to do so. Before we continue, we strongly recommend you have some knowledge about how to use the Second Life Film World tools, such as the edit menu. This will help you follow along better in this tutorial. Alright, let's get started. Here's what you're going to learn in the video today. Unpacking, changing the mouth shape of your avatar's lips. Please make sure to save it as a new shape. Brief description on how to use some of the Second Life Film World tools, i.e. the Second Life Edit menu. How to fit your loud mouth except for the OMG and Danica and how to use appliers for customers only. Please unpack your mouth either by dragging the box in world or wearing the box. If you drop the box in world, you will receive the content, then accept the content and your box should disappear. If you wear the box, you should receive your content and then your box should detach from yourself. Begin by adding your alpha layer. By clicking your avatar, you will see either the pie menu or a scroll down menu. Either way, select appearance or edit appearance and then select edit shape. Shape the lips to the specific number listed on the website in the fitting guide. We will put the link in the description. Please pause the video now if you wish to visit the website and use the fitting guide or continue. Once you have changed the numbers for your shape according to our website, exit edit appearance mode and stand on a post stand. Find your mouth in your inventory. Once you have located your mouth in your inventory, right click and select add. Please note, if you select where, you will detach everything you have in the current slot. Wear your loudmouth 3.0 HUD. The lips will change to the default texture on the HUD and will remain like this until you save a texture on the HUD and apply it to your lips. The reason for this is because the HUD synchronizes all of the mouths and has to coordinate the skin textures between them when attached. Wear any applier you have from any designer. It can be an old or a new one. For this tutorial, I will use the Yum Yum's Cream Skin and Applier. If an applier HUD is blocking the loudmouth HUD, make sure you move the applier so you can clearly see the loudmouth HUD. I'm going to right click the applier HUD, click, edit, and drag it to the right side of the window. Turn on your HUD and go directly to the skin saving menu. We will explain the HUD in more detail in a later video. Click on the plus sign located on the HUD, and then click on the applier to save it to the HUD. Click on the skin texture you've saved on the HUD, then click the button on the top left. Things to note, make sure the texture is the same tone as your skin. Make sure the texture is the same around the septum, part A. Make sure that in part B, the tone lines up. Make sure that in Part C, when you look at your avatar at a profile view of your mouth, sits flush with the chin and also the texture matches. Also take time at this point to check to see if you have any gaps between your mouth and skin. Your mouth should fit flush on top of your avatar's shape.
If the left or the right side of your mouth still doesn't align properly, you can select the mouth on its own by selecting the mouth, edit, and in the edit menu, click on the edit link and also make sure stretch both sides is active. Once you finish the selection, you can now select the left mouth on its own and shape it to either its X, Y, or Z axis. Stretch it out to your liking. Once you have finished, you should have your llama fitted properly. If you are still having issues, please be patient and refer back to this video. You may also find our frequently asked questions on our website listed below. If there are any questions that have not been answered yet, please contact us in world via note card or IM and we will help you as much as we can. Also, please subscribe for upcoming videos. We'll see you in our next video. Thank you for watching.